And with the snow finally melted, the Bemidji boys tennis team gets the chance to finally get outside on the courts. And despite losing their top player from last season, the Jacks still have high expectations. Emily Olson has more. Although the Lumberjacks lost key players from last year, expectations remain high with a lot of experience returning to the 2016 season. We really do have high expectations for the team. We have some really good, uh, talented experience at the top of the lineup. With a high amount of talent at the top of the roster, the next step is developing the newcomers. I think a lot of how well we do as a team will be how much we develop uh, maybe the lower end of our lineup, some of the new kids, some of the kids who have less experience. but. Uh, once we get out of the courts in some good weather, hopefully that'll happen. Although there is room for improvement, the team has high hopes to capture the North title. Expectations are to probably make a good run in sections, hopefully get a section finals at least, maybe get a chance to go to state. I would think that there'll be two to three teams competing for the North title, and I think we can be one of those teams. I don't think we're there yet, but I think we can be one of those teams. With the Bemidji Tennis Team, Emily Olson, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.